Hey guys, Lady H here. Um, for those who don't know me, I run the KOC Ultimate Guides website. This video is going to cover um, how to get bots and for newer players, what bots are. Um, but first, just a quick updates. Um, the website is really lacking on updated guides. So if you have a guide and you can share it, um, my email will be in the description. It is also on the contact page on the website. Um, so if you have a guide, send it in because we really need it. Um, second thing, the background picture on the uh, website I feel needs to be updated. It's been a while since it's been updated. So if you're an artist and you you want to participate in a contest that I might be holding in the near future, um, stay tuned. I'll have more details on how the contest is going to work and what the reward is going to be. Um, so that's that. We'll get to the bots now. Um, I have already installed them all, so I'll just walk you through on how to install them after I have explained to some of you newer players what they are. So um, if you're new to the game, this looks a little bit different than what you're typically looking at, and you'll notice that there are some blue tabs up here. These are the bots. Um, they really help you with the game. As you, you'll notice, I've already brought the chat over here, which is really convenient because you don't have to scroll up and down to have a conversation and play at the same time. Um, for those of you that think the bot is cheating and you choose to play without them, that's fine. Um, just know that I'm pretty sure the majority of KOC players use the bots and you are going to be at a severe disadvantage. Um, as for, there are a few other questions I had. Um, someone asked me if they work on a Mac. Yes, they do. I think there's, you're a little bit limited on the browsers that you can use, but they do work for Mac. I think there's also a couple issues with them, but I don't own a Mac, so I can't honestly tell you. Um, Chromebook. If you're using a Chromebook, I believe the only browser you're able to have on a Chromebook is Google Chrome, which does not support bots. So if you're using a Chromebook, sorry. <laughs> um, you're just not gonna have bots. It's not possible. Um, so the first step in getting bots is you need a browser that supports the bots. Currently I am using Cometbird for this video. I typically use Pale Moon. Firefox users, let me just say this. Firefox gives me more migraines than any other browser combined. They do not mesh very well with bots. I've known a couple people that prefer Firefox over these other browsers, but they're usually the lucky ones that never have a problem. It seems like I always have a problem. I, It just never works out. Firefox is not nice. So if you want a browser that is not going to give you a migraine or that you're not going to have to worry about updating or unupdating a thousand times, get Pale Moon or Comet Bird. Um, there's also Waterfox and Sea Monkey, which I'm not, I've been gone for the game from, for a couple months, so I'm not sure if those two still work. I haven't run into anybody that used those two. Ice Dragon, do not use it. You have to um, turn off your antivirus and your computer protection is just to download it. And if you're like me and you like your computer running the way it's supposed to without viruses, I would just not get it. Just don't even risk it. Um, so after you have a browser downloaded, um, the next thing you're going to want to do is get Grease Monkey or Scriptish, depending on um, which browser you chose and what version. Um, this Comet Bird version is one of the older ones. It's Comet Bird version 11. Um, the monkey that I downloaded for Comet Bird 11 is 9.22.1 signed. For Pale Moon, I use, um, which I've got pulled up here, I use the Pale Moon 
26.1.1. Um, and for that, I use um, Grease Monkey 1.15.1 signed. Um, all of these links are going to be in the description, so don't worry about having to Google them or look them up. They will be in the description. Um, so once you, when you come to this page, you're going to find the right version of Grease Monkey. You're going to click Add to Firefox, which I already did. That's why mine's grayed, grayed out. Um, you're going to get a prompt up here that will say Restart Your Browser, or it'll ask you to. Just restart your browser. Once you have done that, you should have a little monkey icon over here in the corner. Um, you can also check your add-ons, which I've already pulled up, and it should be in extensions. Um, and it'll tell you what version it is. So then after you have monkey, you can then get the box. Um, so there are two bots now. There used to be like three or four of them. Um, there's only two because they've combined them. And they're actually, the new ones are really cool. The, the author did a pretty good job. So you're going to want to get um, KFC PowerBot Plus um, by Barbosa, and then also his TCO, or well, I guess that's a different author, but same difference. So you'll click Install on both of them. They should both appear in your add-ons. Um, once you have them in, then you will refresh your page, your KOC page, and you should have the bots on the top, and you are ready to go. Um, I will be doing more videos on how to use the bots, um, settings to put in, like, you know, what each setting kind of does. I'm still playing with it because there are still a couple of new new features to this new power bot that I'm not sure how to use. So after I've played with them a little bit, I will make a video. Um, so that's it. Um, if anybody has any questions or if you have any information that I missed, go ahead and post comments. Um, or you can contact me again through the... Uh, the contact page here on the website. If you don't want to put your email in, uh, I'll just I'll disable that here shortly. But anyway, you get the gist of it. Um, and that's it. So like, share, send this link to your alliance buddies if you're um, if you're a leader and you're trying to find something to help teach your new players how to get the bots so that you can avoid having a headache on trying to walk them through it. Um, send them this as well. And yeah, that's it. So thanks guys. Thanks for watching.